The world is not ever getting any worse. There's no such thing as the world getting worse unless you believe it. And if you believe the world is getting worse, that means you've watched media. You're sucked in. You're in their reality. That's the devil's reality. The devil wants to suck you in. Don't get caught in the dark. Remember, what you believe, you're going to receive. What you manifest. Because you're a co-creator. That's right. That's how much power you have. Our Heavenly Father, He's the original creator. He's created everything. Everything in existence is here. From beginning to end, it's already been created. There's a peaceful world. There's a hateful world. There's a scary world. There's a heavenly world right here. Yeah, right here. All that exists right here, right now. The question is, what do you believe? What are you seeing? That's the question. If you are seeing scary, if you are seeing hateful, if you are seeing a getting worse world, then you're jaded. You've lost your innocence. And you know what? It's not your fault. It's not. Because like I always said, we have been put down here in a 3D existence. This is a 3D world. It is your duty to ascend. Take it from 3D to 4D and then 5D. Do you understand? The higher density you go, the lighter the world is, the more peaceful the world is, the more happy and joyful the world is. But if you are living in a scary world right now, it's because you've lost your innocence and you're jaded. You believe the media. You believe social media. You believe what this person says or that person. Stop believing in what other people are saying. Start believing in what you want. It's all about what you want. What you truly believe, you're going to see it. Now, here's the thing. Here's the kicker here. You have all the power. I keep saying this on this channel. Channel. You are freaking powerful, man. You're so powerful. You know why you're powerful? Because you are a child of the Almighty. You got God flowing through you. You are light, a light being from heaven. Yes. So even though we're put in this 3D world, this 3D existence, that does not mean you have to stay in this 3D existence. And you have the power, all the power, to jump up, to ascend, to expand your consciousness, to learn lessons, to achieve objectives. That's why you're here. And of course, to give God, our Heavenly Father, all the glory. Come on. Because of Him, we you, me, we are here. But you are a co-creator. You are co-creating everything in this world. Now the thing is, are you co-creating what you want? What truly feels good in your heart? Are you co-creating that? Or are you letting the media and the outside dictate your world? Are you doing that? That's the big question. Because if you are, you don't know that you truly are a co-creator. You don't. Here's what I want you to do. I want you first to realize that you have all the power. You are so powerful. You are so perfect. You are, like I said, a light being from heaven. You got God, our Heavenly Father, flowing through you. And you know what? You can do anything. You are the main painter. You are the star of the show. What painting do you want to paint? What picture do you want to be in? Like I said, you're a co-creator. You can co-create anything and everything that you want because like I said, God has created everything from beginning to end. It all exists already. You just got to pick and choose what you want. It's that simple. And then you got to believe it. You got to truly believe in what you're picking. You got to manifest. Co-create up here first. This is the imagination. Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior, is the imagination. Use that imagination. Create exactly what you want, what you truly want, what you truly believe in. And when you do that and you believe it up here, you're going to see it in your existence. And anything that you do not give attention to, it'll disappear. Gone. That's how awesome this is. Okay, when you realize that you have all the power and that whatever you think up here, whatever you believe, think, believe, and feel up here, it'll begin to exist out there. That's awesome, isn't it? That's awesome, baby. So what world do you live in right now? Are you in a peaceful world? Are you in a happy and joyful heavenly world? Or are you in the opposite? Scary. Uh oh, it's getting worse. What world are you in? What world have you created? <laughs> Yeah, we create everything. Everything. And if you don't know that, then you're asleep. And I got a video on that. Are you awake or asleep? That's coming. So yeah, remember, your reality is warped around you. And you will always be shown what you truly believe. Always. Always. It's not the other way around. This isn't some massive universe and you're just a tiny speck. And I've said that before. I gotta keep saying this. You are massive. You have all the power. You can co-create anything and everything. It's all about you knowing it and you taking charge. Taking a bull by the horns. Becoming that godly painter that you are. Because again, you've got God flowing through you. Oh yeah. It's just like Jesus always said. You know what Jesus said, right? Well, he said many great things. But one great thing. One great thing he said. You ready? And it's very simple. It's very simple. Be as little children. Be as little children. Be like a child. You know why? You know why he said that? Because children are innocent. Children are pure. Children are not jaded. Children are happy and joyful and peaceful and loving. Children are everything that we, you and me, should be. So be as little children. You gotta become a child again. That is how you ascend. That's how you expand your consciousness. That's how you get closer to God and Jesus. You dig? That's the Tripper's way, y'all. Remember, it's all about that love, light, happiness, peace, joy, healing, forgiveness, gratitude, God's mercy and wisdom. Oh yeah. Of course, it's all about God and Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior. Come on. Y'all have a good one. God bless you.